Welcome to Excel Magic Trick 1084. Hey, if you want to download this workbook, and notice this is 1082 to 1083. That's the file. You can click on the link below the video. Hey, back in uh, 182, we saw how to add every other column. And we were looking at odd columns. Now, we saw a few ways how to do this. In particular, we saw how to take this construction right here column minus column plus 1, that gives us an array of numbers. And we saw that the mod function can take each one of those numbers, divide it by 2. That means it will give us, if I hit F9, one remainder, zero remainder, one remainder, zero remainder. Ah, instead of using the mod, we can come down here. And this comes from Rosa Mullen at YouTube. We can use is odd. Now, is odd used to be in the analysis tool pack before 2007, but in recent versions, this has been there for us to use. So I'm just going to put that array of 1 to 7 in there. And now, guess what? If I highlight this and hit F9, boom, it'll give us true for when it's odd. Now I can simply put this inside of some product and take the whole range. And as we mentioned in the last video, if we have different dimensions, that's a bunch by a bunch. But this one right here is just a 1 by 7. Some product, we can't use the array array, but we can use the multiplier. So now, boom, we have our answer using is odd. Now, there's also an is even. In this case, we are adding the odd ones. But what if we wanted? the ones in the even commons, columns, meaning not the ABC. Because watch this, right click, insert, right? It's because we created an array of 1 to 7. It's always going to be dependent on the relationship between the columns and the table, not the actual uh, column headers ABC, Control-Z. But what if we wanted the second ones? We could come over here, Control-C. Control V, and I'm simply going to change this to is even. I'll just highlight that odd even. And then there we go, 188. We could verify that by using our control trick and highlighting the even columns and then looking down at the status bar. There's that sum. 188. Eight. Now, back in 1082, we were only looking at every other for the odds. But right now, if we were to look at the mod, F9, well, it's given us a 1, remainder 1. We could change this array right by saying, uh, put it in parentheses and then asking the question, are you equal to 0? That would mean dividing by 2 would have no remainder. All right, is even, is odd, thanks to Rosen Mullen. All right, we'll see you next video.